Within this old house live two residents. One of them is John Russell, composer, professor. The other has been dead for over 70 years. <laughs> Claire, I'd like to talk to you about the house. Did you die in this house? How did you die? Whatever it is, it's trying desperately to communicate. What is it in that house, Claire? What is it doing? Why is it trying to reach me? Senators, he wants it back. you want to sleep with me? Yes. Then why don't you? Because I love my wife, but it isn't worth jeopardizing my marriage. I shouldn't have been so rude. Thank you for picking up. Mm. The master of the macabre, who shocked audiences everywhere with Sisters, Carrie, Obsession, and The Fury, now invites you to a showing of the latest fashion in murder. <coughs> dressed to Kill. Michael Caine, Angie Dickinson, Nancy Allen. Dressed to Kill. Murder made to order. Bon appétit, Monsieur Poirot. Merci, Hyacinthe. Oh, uh, I do not think that uh, formal introductions are necessary. Poirot, Hercule Poirot. There are those who have called me the greatest detective of all time, a description with which I find it difficult to quarrel. But even a great detective must at times recharge the little gray cells. And I recently took my vacation on an Adriatic island so remote as to be unknown even to the guide Michelin. Hmm? 
hope you haven't come here to practice your sleuthing games on my guests. They've all got far too many skeletons in their cupboards. Alina is my wife. That's all there is to it. Till death do you part. Even in those days, she could always throw her legs up in the air higher than any of us. <laughs> <laughs> and wider. Patrick. Aren't you getting a little tired of rowing? I'm so sorry. Are we late? Patrick insisted upon rowing me right around the island as much bigger than you thought. Poor darling, he's absolutely exhausted. I'm not in the least surprised. Ah! She's been murdered! What the hell do we do now, Odell? Just leave it to me. You know what I'm most sick of in this place. What, madame? Pity. I can't bear to be pitied. Oh, my. I'm the last to arrive. I'm sorry, Sir Horace, but it's my duty to put it to you. That you were furious. You lost your temper. You strangled her. That is poppycock. That is poppycock. I wish you to consider very carefully a bathing cap. A bar, a bottle, a wristwatch, the diamond, the noonday gun, the breath of the sea, and the height of the cliff. You, 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 just wait. Stay, stay right, Linda. You tell her to tell him the truth. But with Hercule Poirot, mysteries never last very long. You are skeptical. Well, perhaps you would care to pit your wits against mine. Bonne chance, mes amis. In Russia, a land of mystery. In Moscow, a city of secrecy. There was one place of peace and safety. A place where an American has been murdered. A place called Gorky Park. Look, no face. Sliced right off. Bodies carved up in the middle of Moscow. Who knows where it could lead? The answers lie somewhere between what is said. It is more than possible that KGB killed those three people. And what is done. I didn't kill him. It doesn't make any difference who pulled the trigger, but you're the one that's gonna pay for it. Between what is known. I have established that you knew all three of them. But what are we talking about? Dead bodies in Gorky Park. And what is hidden. Either you are with them, in which case it doesn't matter where I run. You'll be trapped here. They saw me last night. Between those who enforce the law. I'm saving a life. Whose? Mine. And those who are above it. Corruption is part of us. The very heart of us. Between the lies that are told. Irina, I love you. I've learned to trust nothing. And the truth that lies buried in Gorky Park. My friend is dead. Your friends are dead. Why delude yourself? Why? Now, from the spellbinding international bestseller comes an electrifying motion picture. I've been dealing the whole time, so now they'll deal with me. He doesn't know who to trust. Please, you don't want this case. Where to turn? I have to have a witness. Someone must tell me. Or what might happen if he gets too close to the truth? You should be looked after. Certainly you should be looked after. Orion Pictures presents William Hurt. Lee Marvin, Joanna Pakula, Brian Dennehy, Gorky Park. in this room has the perfect motive Stand back! for murder. What do you mean? Murder. But only one of these suspects is the murderer. Is it the timid Mr. Green? Why are you screaming? Because I'm frightened! Oh, what? Screaming 
or the militant Colonel Mustard. If I was the killer, I would kill you next. Huh? Sit half. Half. Mrs. White, who helped her husband on his way. What's well, a matter of life after death? Now that he's dead, I have a life. Ah! Miss Scarlet, who's helped many men along the way. Practice makes perfect. Huh. Professor Plum, who's looking for a way. I'm looking, I'm looking. Mrs. Peacock. I have absolutely no idea what we're doing here, but I am determined to enjoy myself. Or did the butler do it? No. 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 Paramount Pictures invites you to an evening of mystery. Murder. This is getting quite serious. And madness. In the movie that makes a scene of the crime. So did it! Clue. It's not just a game anymore. This part of the country. It comes from the Alps. <laughs> the blasts of warm air cause snow avalanches. While it blows, there are those who say it causes madness. Any idea why they behave like that? Never done this before. It's probably because of me. I guess they sense the mood I'm in. See, he's not afraid of you. He won't do that for me. Ask him to lead you where the dead bodies are hidden, and he'll lead you. That fly is your magic wand. It's perfectly normal for insects to be slightly telepathic. Yeah, it's normal for insects. But am I normal? I love you. I love you all. We got the bribery conviction locked up. I don't know. It just skirts the edge of entrapment. If you get the wrong judge, you'll throw the case out. Maybe you'll want to make a deal. Yeah, I knew you were the right guy to talk to. I don't think we should offer a deal now. I think we should get a conviction. Then we can offer a That's deal. And I want you to ask for very high bail. Let him sweat. Detective Remy McSwain grew up on the force. I've never seen one person break so many laws in such a short space. Well, forget about the laws for a minute. He knows the way the system works. This is New Orleans, darling. Folks have a certain way of doing things down here. People like to show their appreciation. So when a renegade cop turns from petty payoffs to big time hits. How come an assistant district attorney and an official corruption strike force is suddenly so interested in a routine mafia hit? It isn't just another case. Why'd you withhold this information from the police, huh? The police are the suspects. It's a family affair. Why don't you like me? Or why don't you trust me, then? You're a cop, for God's sake. You're supposed to uphold the law. But instead, you bend it, twist it, and sell it. We take care of our own. Remember that. the way 
the system works, but things can change. Down in the Big Easy, people do everything their own way. Living, loving, and tracking down... I'm a cop! ...a killer. A candy-colored clown they call the Sandman Tiptoes to my room every night Just to sprinkle stardust and to whisper Go to sleep, everything is all right I close my eyes Then I drift One name that keeps coming up is this woman singer. The first thing I need is to get into her apartment. I don't know if you're a detective or a pervert. Do you like the way I feel? I still can see blue velvet. Mr. Angel, my client, Monsieur Louis Sapper. Do you by chance remember the name Johnny Favorite? My interest is only in finding out if he's alive or if he's dead. You want me to check it out? Private detective paid to snoop around. He's dead, Mr. Angel. Well, you know what they say about slugs. They always leave slime in their tracks. Are you afraid? Yeah, I'm afraid. I'm a murder suspect already in two cases. Did you kill him? No, but the cops might think I did. The Prince of Darkness protects the powerful. The egg is the symbol of the soul. Did you know that? It's funny, I have a feeling I've met you before. Quiet in there, babe. I checked in this morning with my wife. Yes. And while I was in the shower, she left the room. Yes. And she hasn't come back. And she left with the man who had called her. He had his arm around her. He could have had it done. Like this. Here. What would you like us to do exactly? I want you to find my wife. No one will believe him. I hope you know what you're doing, Dr. Walker. Listen! And only one person in Paris can help him. My wife. What wife? My wife. She's about to lead him. You will get your wife, I will get my money, and everybody will be happy. Into a world as mysterious as she is. Stop lying to me! Now! What began as a holiday in Paris became a journey into suspense. Harrison Ford in a Roman Polanski film, Frantic. Don't 
I heard from one of you guys you caught a good one. Face down taxpayer back of the head in his own bed. Your guy put an ad in the singles magazine, right? There's some psycho woman out there killing guys. Wanna know how we catch her? We put our own ad in. We set up dates with 30, 40, 50 of the ladies who answer. We take them out, some restaurant, some bar, get their prints on a wine glass. Bingo, she's dropped. I don't believe in wasting time on this kind of stuff. You know what you know and you go with it. You go with what? I believe in animal attraction. I believe in love at first sight. I believe in this. No offense, but you never did get her prints, did you? She's not the shooter. I have done some desperate, foolish things. You mean like being here with me? Um, You're a good man. You never know. I always know. I always know. You just met her. What are you looking for, huh? She's a friggin' suspect, Frank. Just walk away. This is getting out of hand.